More than a month from the November general election. It's time that we say no to the politicians. On one side, a campaign urging voters to say yes to Prop 6, ultimately repealing the state's 12 cent per gallon gas tax increase. The other side pushing for a no vote. There's a lot at stake with Prop 6. During a news conference at the state capitol, supporters of the tax repeal announced a plan to fix roads without a tax hike. Dollar for dollar, we can fill every pothole, Dollar for dollar, we can expand our roads to meet a growing population to reduce congestion. Their proposal to replace Prop 6 calls for several things, including all state gas tax funds to go exclusively to road projects, dedicating car sales tax to infrastructure, ending the high-speed rail project, and requiring annual audits. To do that, gas tax opponents are proposing another ballot measure, but their plan is years away. Their proposed measure would be on the 2020 ballot. We want to make sure that we are efficiently spending every dime for road improvements or infrastructure projects. But opponents of the gas tax repeal call all of this a distraction. Prop 6, which is on this November's ballot, is a dangerous initiative that would eliminate the funding for 6,500 bridge and road projects that are currently underway. And every idea that was put out at this event uh, was ideas that were ultimately already rejected by the legislature. We need to get serious about California's failing infrastructure. Today, the No on Prop 6 campaign launched statewide ads claiming Prop 6 would also eliminate more than $5 billion in existing transportation funds each year. What we have is a better system in place where we can use user fees funded with fees at the pump and on vehicles and keep that money dedicated towards road and transportation projects. The decision on what happens next rests in the hands of voters like Bob and Carol Stearns who want to repeal the state's gas tax. And I just think uh, California is robbing us, uh, you know, as taxpayers, and uh, we pay enough in taxes for everything else. I can afford the gas, but there's a lot of people who can't.